Lewis asked, uh, he said he's seen videos of the F-16 parked where the engine cone is opening and closing. So what he's referring to is the very back part of the engine right here. The official term is turkey feathers. It's the nozzle. The purpose of the nozzle is to open and close to control the thrust coming out the back of the airplane. Now, when that nozzle closes during your ground operations, your start procedures in the F-16, you go through a number of checks. One of those checks is to check the secondary engine of the engine. We call it SEC mode, short for secondary. And PRI mode is primary. So when you're just flying around the F-16 on any given day, it's flying around in PRI mode that's the primary mode of the engine now if there's certain types of emergency you go to sec that's secondary there's a switch a red guarded switch in the cockpit where you can put yourself into sec and there are certain emergencies that put you into sec it is a simpler version of the engine so you have slightly less operational capability but it gets you home safely that's kind of the purpose of it there it's a fallback mode of the engine and we check it every single day that we fly by Pulling, lifting up the red guard and flipping the switch, putting the engine in sec mode. And when you put it in sec mode, the nozzle closes. And now it is stuck in the closed position. It's locked there. What that does is it maximizes your thrust for your throttle setting. It actually ends up that when you come into land in sec mode, you are landing with about twice the normal thrust that you would in idle. So you have to keep that in mind on touchdown because you tend to float the airplane because you have more thrust than you're used to. Now, if the opposite were true, if the turkey feathers, the nozzle got stuck in the open position, you would have less thrust than you're used to. But what typically happens is as you fly around and you push the throttle forward into mill power or pull it back into idle power, the engine is constantly adjusting those turkey feathers, your nozzle, to adjust the amount of thrust coming out the back of the airplane. So you go to mill power and it's going to close down that nozzle to give you the maximum thrust. But then you go into afterburner and it actually opens back up because there's so much thrust and so much fire coming out the back end of the aircraft at that moment that the, the uh, nozzle needs to actually open back up. So what you see it when it's parked on the ground, you see it going through its checks. When it's airborne, you will actually see the nozzle opening and closing depending on throttle setting. It's a good question. If you have more like it, ask it in the comments.